This is a quick tutorial on how to enter blog posts into the weekly 100 word challenge. The first thing you need to do is uh, make sure each entry has its own blog post. So on my blog here I've got uh, ICRA's entry. Uh, first thing you do is click on the entry so that it has its own page, goes onto its own page here and you can check that because you'll have the URL up here and you can see it says 100 word challenge ICRA, the same as the title. And you uh, copy that URL and then you need to go to the 100 word challenge website which I have as a link here so I can just quickly do that. If you don't have the link the address is 100wc.net. You scroll down to this week's challenge which is number 18, week 18 and you can see the prompt there and you can see all the entries that have already been linked and each of those will be linked back to the that school's website or uh, that class's blog. So you click here to enter and it will take you to a Linky Tools page. There's an HTTP uh, box here, you highlight that and just paste over the top and you paste in that URL from your own blog and then you need to put in the title and I put in uh, Springwell my class name and the name of the person whose entry it is which is ICRA and I just always double check that I've got the URL that says ICRA and the title that says ICRA there because once you've made a mistake you can't really go back and change it. When you feel happy you click enter your link and that will create a link between your blog and the 100 word challenge and you should see if you go to the blog hosting this list, if you click there, go back to the page, just scroll down, we should see ICRA's entry right at the bottom as the last entry. There we go and now all she has to do is keep checking the, her blog page for any comments that will be made on um, how fantastic her writing is and what she can do to get better. If you have several entries to enter, you can stay on the Linky Tools um, site and you can keep entering one after the other, but it does pay to go and check each one um, as you do it, just so that there are no mistakes. And that's all there is to it.